KBOI 2 News is watching out for you. The latest health inspection at the Boise Co-op did not go well. Inspectors turned up more violations. Morgan Wagner asked the co-op manager how this sort of thing could happen again so close to the heels of the salmonella outbreak. Morgan, what did he have to tell you? Brent, the manager told me he wasn't sure exactly how it happened. He says there's obviously still some kinks in the system that haven't been sorted out yet. Following the salmonella outbreak that caused hundreds of its patrons to get sick, the Boise Co-op Deli raised some flags in its most recent health inspection. We went in and we took our inspection report and we looked at those 49 risk factors um, and there were three violations between two of their different departments. The co-op was cited for having meat in its coolers that were out of date or did not have dates on them at all. The salad bar was not keeping food stored at the right temperatures and dirty gloves were found leaning against a clean cutting board. It's alarming violations that one customer says she's surprised to see happen. After the first incident, you would have thought they would have bent over backwards to not let this happen a second time. And this is really damaging PR for the co-op. Knowing the co-op has had to make a lot of changes, I asked the manager what went wrong. Send people to serve safe, then you changed all these things. So how? How could this happen again? Well, like I said, it's um, yeah, it's 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 kind of perplexing to us too. Why? Because it seems like we invested a lot and we talked about it a lot, and it just seems like that probably was not enough for one or two instances where somebody's making a decision. The deli was able to fix or fix those violations on the site that day before inspectors left. Um, the manager tells me that this is not going to stop them from moving forward with their story. Live in Boise, Morgan, w Morgan Wagner, KBOI 2 News.